Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. This is Dr. Aya, your natural Zen diva. Uh, today I wanted to talk about, um, it was so funny because I just got off the phone with one of my classmates and colleagues and it's just amazing to me that we're all starting to realize the same thing now that we've been out of school for some years now and we're starting to realize that we're starting to realize that even though you go to school for all of these years and you know you, you think you want to work so hard for someone that as you start to have kids and start to have a family you realize that you know what's really important in life and one of the things that doesn't seem so important is getting up and having to go to a job that you don't really like and you know um, work hard for someone when your kids are away from you when you can't raise your children how you want to and it's just a mindset change because you know we're like dang we went to school for all of these years and then to realize it's something that you don't really want to do like oh you know that can be kind of upsetting especially when you have tens of thousands of dollars of school loans to still pay back <laughs> okay which is why a lot of us are looking for additional streams of income that job you know if you want to get out of debt if you want to go uh, you know pay for your children's school so they don't have um, school loans or whatever your goals are and you look at your job and you can you can actually look and see what you're going to be making for the next five ten years and you can see exactly what you'll be able to pay off you know what you'll be able to do because your salary is set whereas when you have an additional stream of income when you own your own business especially a home-based business you know that is money that's just extra money a lot of the times especially if you go if you really focus on growing that home-based business your income will supersede what you make at the job so you know that is a really I mean, it's, 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 a, it's really serious to think about that because, you know, I have had people ask me if I had to do it over again, would I have went to college? And, you know, I think about that and I'm like, you know, I, I don't know. I can't honestly say that I would have. Um, you know, I spent so much, I spent six years in school on top of all your time in elementary school, middle school, high school, then college. You know, it, it's a lot of time. It's a lot of years. And I think, dang, you know, if I had really focused on something or got a skill or a craft and mastered it, I mean, you know, if I had started a home-based business when I was 18, you know, I'd have been a millionaire by now. You know, whereas I'm paying off school debt and working hard for someone. So it's, it's kind of like, you know, you, you have to look at it. I know some people will be like, well, Io, you already have a degree, so you could say that. And I know especially my older folks, because we know y'all do not want to hear that college may not be the, this big secret key that you think it is. Because I have plenty of friends that have degrees, and guess what? They don't have a job. Okay, so I mean, I know back in the day, that's what we were taught. We were taught, go to school, go to school. That's how you're going to get a good job. Well, now that, you know, with our generation, our, our, we're starting to shift our thinking a little bit and realize that maybe getting a job is really, getting a good job is not the key because you could get fired at any time. They don't have to give you notice to fire you. Okay, they could be like, oh, bye bye. We don't want you to come back today. So, you know, it, it, it's, it's really serious when you, you can sit down and think. And I know with my children, especially, I'm not pushing, you know, go to college so much. I'm pushing more from now. Let's build that entrepreneurial spirit, which not everyone has. You know, I'm not mad at you. There's got to be employees and there's got to be employers. So a lot of us, you know, we're shifting to the employer side and that's what we want to do. So it's really something to think about where you, you go to school for all those years, you're, you have degrees, you're not working in the field that you have a degree in, and then you have, you have to have two or three different jobs. Then after you retire, you didn't been in this job 20, 30 years, you retire and which your retirement pay doesn't cover any, it doesn't cover enough of your bills. It doesn't co cover the cost of living. I mean, it's a vicious cycle. So instead, I say invest in yourself, 
Invest in yourself. No, it's not easy to run a home-based business, especially not to have a successful home-based business. But you have to put in work. You have to be committed. You have to be consistent. I know people who have been with their same organization for 17 years. You know, so it's not a it's not a get rich quick scheme okay that's not what it is having a home-based business is not a get rich quick scheme it's not something that's gonna make you a million dollars in two weeks if you want to take your chance and play the lotto instead go for what you know but I'm gonna go ahead and take control of my destiny take control of my future and put in the work that I have to put in to make my business succeed all right that's the message of the day. All right, gotta go. Bye-bye. Next time, tune in. Natural Zen Diva. Ios out.